Who is Jesus? For 2,000 years, people have been asking this question. Jesus himself even posed it to his followers. Who do you say that I am? Some say he was a historical figure, a man, a carpenter from Nazareth. Others say he was a prophet sent by God. Still others say he was a philosopher or a moralist or a religious revolutionary. Some even say Jesus was a myth. But what does the Bible say? The Bible tells us that Jesus was a man and gives us the details of his birth, life, and death. But the Bible also tells us that Jesus is the Son of God, even God himself. In fact, the name Jesus means Jehovah the Savior. He is also called the Everlasting Father, the Mighty God, and Emmanuel, meaning God with us. So is Jesus man or is Jesus God? The answer is he's both. The Bible tells us that Jesus is both the true God and at the same time, he is a real man. This God-man Jesus lived a perfect and sinless human life on the earth. After 33 and a half years, he died on the cross to take away our sins and to save us from the curse of sin, death. He sacrificed himself in order to save us. But because he's also the eternal God, it was impossible for death to hold him. He resurrected after three days and became a life-giving spirit. Now Jesus can come into our human spirit and give us the eternal life of God. He's available everywhere and to everyone who believes in him. So who is Jesus? He's more than a historical figure. He's our savior. He's God with us. He's here waiting for us to open to him so he can wash away our sins and fill us with his life. We only need to confess our sins and believe in Jesus to receive him as our Savior. You can do this right now with a simple prayer. Lord Jesus, I believe in you as my Savior. Thank you for dying for me. Lord, forgive me of my sins and wash them away. Lord Jesus, I receive you right now. Thank you for coming into me. Amen. Let it come.